With iScan's native programming features, you are able to update or replace the door modules on many Land Rover models. Your customer may experience malfunctioning door control switches. The remedy for this could be a simple software update. Before beginning, be sure to check for the latest app and vehicle updates. If needed, update before continuing. Confirm that you are connected to a stable internet connection. With late model DOIP-based Land Rovers, 2017 and newer, you must be connected via Wi-Fi and not Ethernet, as that connection type will cause an IP conflict with the vehicle's communication protocols. Connect to suitable vehicle power supply. If working with your scan tool outside the vehicle, be sure to route the cable so it doesn't interfere with window operation. Confirm your iScan device displays a vehicle voltage of 13.0 to 13.9 volts. With our subject vehicle, a 2019 Range Rover L405 chassis, we are going to update the passenger door module software to the latest available calibration file. Before programming, you'll want to note the current software part number and calibration number. You can do this using iScan diagnostic software under body system in the passenger front door module PDM information menu item. The last few digits will change if a newer software calibration file is available after the programming session is complete. This step is only required for programming an existing module. When replacing a module, you can skip this step. You can simply email yourself this page by clicking the ellipsis in the upper right hand corner, report output, email diagnostic information on current page. Now we are ready to program the module. Tap Euro. Tap Land Rover. Tap Programming. Read and understand message. Tap to continue. Read and confirm the vehicle state matches the instructions on screen. Tap Enter to continue. Confirm that the correct vehicle details are displayed. Tap to continue. Tap Module Programming. In our case, we are updating software on the existing passenger front door module, PDM. Tap Update ECU. Tap Passenger Front Door Module, PDM. Read and confirm message. Tap Enter to continue. On this screen, the current software and calibration numbers are also displayed. Tap Enter to start programming. Confirm ignition is still on and the vehicle did not go to sleep. Tap Enter to continue. Software file is now being downloaded from the cloud and once the download is complete, programming will commence. Once programming of the first module is complete, cycle the ignition off, then back on. Tap Enter to continue. The remaining door modules will be programmed. Follow the on-screen prompts to complete each module. Programming is complete. Cycle the ignition off, then back on. Tap Enter to continue. In this step, follow on-screen instructions and close all windows. Tap Enter to continue. Keep windows free of obstructions. All windows will cycle down and back up. Tap Enter to continue. Programming is complete. Tap Enter to continue. Verify the software calibration numbers have been updated. You do this by comparing your saved module information from earlier. In our example, newer software was available as the read software part number changed from CA to CB. Also note that the calibration number changed from AF to AG. This confirms that the software calibration was updated after programming. If the same software part numbers are displayed after programming, no newer software was available. If you are programming a new replacement module that requires adaptations, initializations, or calibrations after programming is complete, the iScan software will direct you to complete those necessary functions. Check out our other videos and articles for more helpful tips and procedures for Land Rover vehicles.